<laughs> okay. Uh, yeah. I wanted to record this with my friend uh, from journalists. Before it was a question of uh, spirituality, which seems so unimportant now because <laughs> it's so abstract and so it's who cares who believes in what now but now the, 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 the same story take a very new angle that I never took very seriously because it was it was a joke like the question of feminism <laughs> and the fact that I would be <laughs> the, um, the big bad wolf. <laughs> mm -hmm. So, this, this is the big bad wolf. This story is in 2011, I think. And I am in a school of yoga in Montreal on Rue Saint Denis where anybody could go, <coughs> but it was a sect. <laughs> but when you just go there just to do yoga, nobody knows it, so it's low profile. But if you do like me and you, you start a teacher training, then it will lead you oh, very far. Teacher training, yeah. So, yeah. so um, Because I've been sent there by a friend who had a company of uh, food, raw food, and we had plans to get together to, to. We were talking about making a, a eco village, mm -hmm. so we were like close. We we had a lot. There there was a lot of respect between us. And I was sent in the school to bring food <laughs> first. I, uh, I, I, I was doing delivery. And uh, I came there, I met the woman, click and very quick. Did I had the food, food delivery for the yoga school? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was, uh, it was uh, just uh, it was an open day, I guess. Mm -hmm. Open day, like discovery. She was a lot uh, doing promotion and uh, showing off. <laughs> and um, I'm showing off. <laughs> um, and there was also a big link in between this friend with a uh, food restaurant and her enough that at the end but you, you during the, the yoga training teacher training he was coming to do some intervention during the meals and at the intervention yeah talking about food uh, talking oh, okay. some preach <laughs> making preaches <laughs> but, <laughs> and me i was bringing chips <laughs> <laughs> like I was the bad boy, <laughs> but you know, <laughs> it was uh, I had chips for free, and <laughs> I was bringing chips. So <laughs> but it, it was fun for me just to <laughs> being the bad boy. You know, that's the thing. I'm always playing, like making, like just play a play, just to play, <laughs> just to to make things that are not in the main line. Mm -hmm. So everybody, everybody there is a very nice. They eat chips at home, man. Even that friend, he mm -hmm. was with his girlfriend once, and they were eating eating chips in the street. <laughs> and he said to his girlfriend, "Take the the bag of chips. I don't want to be seen with that <laughs> <laughs> because if there's people recognizing recognizing me, they, I must not have <laughs> chips in the end. So mm -hmm. it's it's a lie. Mm -hmm. So I was bringing <laughs> chips and whatever what the people think and you see." I get problems because I do things like that. You <laughs> like to shock. <laughs> I like to shock. Voila. Mm -hmm. 
Voilà. So I got I began to study there, and I had the feeling that um, because of all these links, uh, um, I had my place in the circle, the big circle. Mm -hmm. But um, yeah, because I, we had plans together and he had plans with her and she she was res respecting me a lot and I was respecting her a lot and there was a strong connection between between the teacher the yoga teacher mm -hmm. and and me because uh, the woman yeah she was really um she had something what I would call the, um, the tita zone the, the cere cerebral Zone. We could together sometimes. Oh, yeah, well, this uh, this contemplation zone of like mm -hmm. being very wide open. Mm -hmm. Sometimes we were sitting front to front and meditating long time in the eye, eyes open. Mm -hmm. Feeling one strong sentence, one. At the time, at the same time, to meditate. Once we had a little, because I made a, I made a um, homework that she didn't like, um, because I was uh, talking bad about, uh, I don't know. Well, yeah, I, I was not believing in. It. In the yoga, uh, esoteric the masters, so <coughs> I made a homework just more putting. What exactly did you not believe? In? Oh, I don't believe. You in didn't like. You didn't believe in the Western point of view in yoga. I don't believe in any esoteric uh, <coughs> things. I'm very. But then you just do yoga for whatever you don't have to do. No, no. I do yoga for for bringing into that zone of full presence in which there is some kind of spirituality. Mm -hmm. Like a friend today just told me, oh, you're so spiritual. Okay, if you want to say that. That's not something I would say about myself, but in my quest, there is something that is that goes along with spirituality. Mm. Still recording. <laughs> <laughs> um. <coughs> But this guy from the raw food organization knew the yoga teacher already. Yeah, yeah, they knew each other. From yoga, or maybe, mm. maybe. Yeah, she was a uh, she was a uh, gathering big spirit of Montreal. Even one guy recently, I was so happy, he got caught by a scandal like he was abusing women, and he had such an ego. This he was. Unbearable, unbearable for mm, me. I didn't I like it. Oh yeah, yeah. I, I don't like uh, these. But uh, he worked with her, or he? Uh, no, 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 no. He was uh, visiting her school. Mm -hmm. But what I mean is, there were there were a lot of uh, very proud people and uh, um, how to say uh, people that are realizing in themselves into uh, charismatic. Yeah, in business, <laughs> mm. like making business out of charisma. charisma. Mm. So I was not doing business, but I, were, I was proud to be recognized for some kind of charism. And that's why she was interested in, into me and I was interested into her as, a, as somebody who can lead me into this zone of mm -hmm. wildness. Right, she was saying things during the classes that were like beyond any spirit, uh, any uh, no, no spiritual, like very 
physical, uh, lift up your hands, uh, <laughs> straight up your leg, and <laughs> during uh, the mm -hmm. classes that are so military. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, that's so. Yeah. <laughs> that's sad. <laughs> yeah. So once she was saying, uh, spirits are among us, the ancient, no, she was saying, the ancient are among us, mm -hmm. helping our practice. And I could feel like if I was straightening my, my hand, there was a hand on the taking it and making it easier. You could really feel it? Yeah, I could really feel. Mm -hmm. But for me, it was poetry. Mm -hmm. yeah? <laughs> that's, that's the whole point. <laughs> for me, esoteric is poetry. So as long as somebody is, is using images of esoteric world like the painter Alex Gray I love Alex Gray mm -hmm. but um, hopefully it's only painting so I, I don't have Alex Gray beside telling me this is true no it's okay, this electric field around the body when you do yoga you can feel it if you are really in the mm -hmm. zone open you can really feel I don't want to believe too far from reality, which we don't know. There is a gray zone yeah. that I don't know myself. I don't, and I don't want to label. I don't want to. I will never write about that because I would have nothing to say because I don't know, and I don't want to pretend anything. Just poetry. You, I want. I've been writing a book called the Meditation des Terrestres, is making poetry out, out of this free presence mm -hmm. but no it's extraterrestrial mm -hmm. <laughs> no no ghost no past lives no no entities no, no, no. Mm -hmm. we don't need that we don't need this brain brain is just too much the brain is but you don't want to think about that or you just don't believe in it or? i've been thinking a lot mm -hmm. to that and that's why there is a gray zone. I'm very interested in quantum physics, like mm -hmm. everybody in this world of mm -hmm. yoga, like like making big stories about that. And people are making so many stories about about quantum physics, where it's only theories and it's only a, a mathematic mm -hmm. uh, representation of the world that has no pretension to reality. Eh? It's mm -hmm. only a, but it's interesting. It's so interesting. It's op it's opening a wider, wider spectrum of reality. What is reality? How far it goes? Mm -hmm. I'm interested in two perceptions, and this is only just beneath the yeah. the perceptions, which we don't perceive. But if we add the eye of the eagle, the eagle, if we add the the strength of this animal, and if we add the, like the, the the nose of a dog, and if we had the the, the reality would go further, mm -hmm. and this is really interesting, and further, and even a bit further because there is something beyond what the dog can can smell and beyond what the eagle can see. So there is from to smaller to smaller to smaller to smaller. Mm -hmm. That's very interesting, but mm -hmm. we can only touch that by poetry, and I truly believe that. Prophets, they, they, they were poets. Mm. They were so not. Poetry is your religion. <laughs> mm, it's not a religion. So. <laughs> so. But prophets are always misunderstood. Or, or they use people, they manipulate. I don't know. But true prophets, they don't do that. Those who manipulate it is uh, the follower, like the most of the time I would I would believe that, mm. like those uh, who, who take the, the religion in charge because the prophet is dying and then they don't want to make a, a church, but followers are taking it, and taking the, the believers behind and hey, mm. <laughs> hey, <laughs> and they take in charge. Uh, mm. And they impose because like, they are too afraid to swim. 
they, they want structures and uh, physical things. Well, no, it's not a physical thing. Something to cling to. Many people believe in what they want and uh, well, what is their purpose? I often not purpose, but their goal. Mm -hmm. Maybe Paul de Tars who created uh, Christianism after Jesus. Jesus was not a Christian. He was a Jew. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. He was that, a. That, but that will everybody recognize. Yep, sorry. Everybody will recognize that because that's so bad. <laughs> uh, mm. There's a lot of things said about <laughs> Jesus. And the but Jesus <coughs> was not a Christian. <laughs> no, but uh, even that is very funny. Just to just to say that to realize that yeah. he was not Christian. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so, uh, so the the year goes well. I feel very, um, my ego is really comfortable. But because you, you were still following the course. Yeah, of course. I was still, and I was mm -hmm. really going every two or three days. Uh, mm -hmm. I would say two days. Every two days. Uh, she gave me my free pass of yoga because uh, in exchange I was uh, putting uh, flyers of the school everywhere in the city. Mm -hmm. And a, a bit because of this uh, attraction, mm -hmm. when they say a master and the and the apprenti, the pupil, and the master and the pupil, there is an attraction. Mm -hmm. The pupil wants to know from the teacher. The teacher wants to see this pupil coming to him. Mm -hmm. to, like when I was saying. Uh, she rejected me because I was more. I, I created a. I, I wrote for as a homework a, a traité on Heraclite that was more talking about the, the non essentialist, non main Platonician philosophe who was more thinking of the the multiplicity of everything and not the identity of anything and no no beyond there is no place for any beyond like no paradise no no elsewhere with Heraclit. Mm -hmm. Heraclit is totally uh, at this um, from the same time like Heraclit, Heraclit yeah. was born and dead at the same time than uh, the Buddha and they are mostly saying the same and even the, the the image of the the river says he never go inside a river two times means there's never the same river mm -hmm. because it's always changing, changing, changing. Even when I was changing, changing, it's mm -hmm. going ka from vipassana, mm -hmm. changing, changing. <laughs> Still recording. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so, um, but you wrote, um, yeah, you wrote about it? and she she was angry because I was joking about shocking again, again. I was, I don't know, I don't remember well, but just saying that I was putting the esoteric into garbage, mm. and she put me out of the school. But then I came back very humble. And, I, and we had this one of these uh, famous meeting together of being very silent mm -hmm. face to face. Just one was saying somebody something, and the other just time to receive, time to formulate into the most perfect and precise way. I could, she's, I said, <laughs> I said, um, because the, she had nothing to say this time much, it was said, she kicked me out, so I said, um, the, um, Taya, how long is Taya? Taya? Taya. 
Et ta tea. Et tailleur, et tailleur. Non, une tailleur uh, means like you have oh, tea inside uh, of it. Yeah. Teapot. A teapot. Yeah. <laughs> the cup has become empty and I'm going to the teapot. meaning okay I'll shut up <laughs> <laughs> okay you want to teach me esoteric I can okay I'll put aside my my, my thinking about it and I'll um, I'll, I'll make my, I'll make my hair I'll make presents on myself to, to receive so she took me back in the school and but she why if you are not in, interested in <laughs> or like if well, you well because her poetry, <laughs> I wanted, I wanted still to have these ancient around me to hold my body when I do yoga. Mm -hmm. I didn't want to finish in the school. <laughs> Lift the leg, <laughs> higher. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I wanted something high. Mm -hmm. I wanted to do yoga in, a, in, a, in this. This way, and I had respect for her, mm -hmm. and um, I still have, mm -hmm. or not, difficult to say. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So the word the, the year went very good, and uh, life was perfect. Very good understanding. My my, my pride, my ego was. Uh, Caressed by the sight of a master looking well at her pupil. <laughs> very good, very good. <laughs> <laughs> Big game. <laughs> Until the day. Where she presented it again. It's a new game. And she was making making it very light and <laughs> funny. <laughs> we will play um, the game of the victim and the um, perpetrator. Hmm? Perpetrator. Perpetrator. Mm. What is that? Perpetrator. The guy who's cutting the head. Uh, yeah. Sadist. So, so I had to play a game of being the sadist. Mm. I was doing performance. I was doing theater. Mm. I like to go deep and far into something and I was doing Bhutto uh, to, with a teacher if you, one year before she learned us uh, yeah she you know in Bhutto how far we can go eh? mm -hmm. and um, we were um, we were doing a, an exercise where you uh, you have a, 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 you are mm -hmm. blindfolded and uh, you have a, a, a um, element in the mouth. A lemon? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And people on a very, very aggressive music, people are running over around you and they hit you. Yeah. And you have to, 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 to come to this rage inside until you spit the, the lemon and then you... <laughs> And this was a Bhutto With who was performance. It? With who, with which it, uh, it's Martin Vial, a uh, very interesting teacher mm -hmm. that people love and hate mm -hmm. for very good reason to love, very good reason <laughs> to hate. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
And uh, I kept that from uh, this exercise because this same year I was uh, receiving yoga from the school. I was myself giving uh, classes uh, to little group. Of yoga? Oh. No, I was calling that uh, Tantra Transdance. No Tantra, like a cheesy Californian thing, but Tantra like related to Tibetan's uh, mm. teaching. Mm. Coming from this friend uh, with a restaurant. Because this friend, before to have a restaurant, was my first uh, uh, teacher of meditation in a tantric way, like tantric, tantric, Tibetan tantric, like just mastering energies, mm -hmm. not sexualities. Mm -hmm. um, and I, uh, I'm talking about Bhutto and these things, and uh, because um, this kind of sadic <laughs> exercise, like people rushing on, on somebody that receiving all this violence, intensity, to spit the, 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 the lemon. I wrote that in my, in my lesson. And uh, I did this and I wanted to, okay, me, I never pushed far enough. Huh? I never, okay, when, after five minutes of being like attacked, mm -hmm. like, okay, I decided to spit the lemon, but you were not really good enough? No, yeah. not enough. Yeah, I, I was wondering what happens with people who, who go to the opposite instead of going into the anger, they go into the... like into themselves or... Oh, like, uh, well, mm, interesting. But maybe that's why... Yeah, that, that, would, that would be somebody who is not... not responding so just taking taking violence inside mm -hmm. wow yeah this is a that's very... dangerous it's a dangerous exercise yeah uh, yes it is a dangerous mm -hmm. exercise I, I did it i was not realizing at what point mm -hmm. but when i did it went very good and then in the Bhutto school too mm -hmm. when i did especially the no, 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 Bartinvial. Oh. Bartinvial is from Quebec. Mm. Went well. Uh, it went well. Especially, it's interesting, I want to note, it's very important to talk about that because I, there was one, uh, I wanted that she feels one of my students. Mm. And I was like pushing, tearing the you know, things that are really, oh, yeah, when somebody tear, tear on my hair, like, this makes me angry. Mm -hmm. That's something that somebody should do to make me angry, like, oh, this, like pain, some pain are making me angry. Mm -hmm. uh, so I was doing these things to, to bring her where, where we need to go. And, uh, and I've touched a little her dress, not like, mm -hmm, like no, just... Like, as mm. if I was in a subway and I was like a, like a, this kind of girl, like, you know. And just to, because it's not fun for women to be touched there, and it's mm. so in, invasive. And, mm. and at the end, uh, okay, like, she spit the lemon, she cries, and and in and, and Bhutto we were just looking, but, but uh, the way I was doing that, uh, after giving her space to express, at the end we were coming and giving her a big hug. And after she told me how, how happy she was to have touched this and experiment this and being able to, to refuse this because this is the, all, the, the big violence that we are giving her. When she spit the lemon, then it's the moment she refused this. She takes her place and she... Mm -hmm. Ah, affirmation. Mm -hmm. And you know, eight years uh, later, we were talking together uh, today. Which is, uh, today? Well, <laughs> today. It's a coincidence. So we are still good friends. Mm -hmm. And she, she, she's, she's still marked by... My, my workshops were really intense in many ways. Like energetic work and emotional work. Mm -hmm. Now, back to the school, I have to play the sadist. 
so that's after or it's like during yeah, it was after it was few weeks after my own mm. so okay and because i kept this idea of like and i touched your breast a little same and well I, you I was, wait, wait, wait. what I, was the what was the scene in this okay it was well, okay the class the classroom uh, the, there is uh, we are uh, Jumelé, couples. couples of people. One is the sadist, one is we see as the victim, mm -hmm. and we are doing the most we we can so the, the other can feel the, to be a victim. So I don't know what we're doing the others, no? if they were playing the game or just saying. <laughs> so mm -hmm. I don't know. I know. I was trying to to make her feel. If the point is to be uh, to be oppressed, I was trying to do my best to to oppress her. Mm -hmm. It's not that I like it, not I'm that, that I like to play sadist, mm -hmm. but uh, I know what it is to be aggressed in life. To be, uh, so okay, I was doing it. Yeah. Very good. Uh, she 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 tries to fly to to go away. I run after her. No no no. Okay, but. Oh, very good. Mm. Then I, I get uh, I am victim. I don't know if <coughs> I don't know if it's from her, but I guess yes. Very good. The year continue on its wave. At the end of the year, like June, the teacher is uh, calling me like, my son, you have to be there tonight at seven in the school. If it's safe. So I go there, and the girl is there with her boyfriend, and she wants the girl that that has been, that with who I was playing uh, the okay. game. Okay, I thought you did you did the, this with the yoga teacher. No, 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 uh, not, no. It was with a girl, with okay. a girl from the class, mm -hmm. and she was uh, shocked still after maybe one or two months of this exercise. Mm -hmm. And uh, and I had to explain it. Like, sorry, I was just trying to do my best uh, to feel the exercise. Uh, you have to feel to be a victim. This is, this is the best I could do to <laughs> let you feel <laughs> as a victim. <laughs> I don't like to do that. It was very uh, awful exercise. Mathieu did the same, uh, uh, the same, uh, Ma oh yeah, Mathieu. Mathieu is the, the guy from the restaurant. Okay. He did the same because after, I think it's after, he was doing also workshops. With the yoga teacher. With something elsewhere. Mm. And there there was a salvator, so the prosecutor, the victim, and the, and the salvator. Yeah. And you know what, <laughs> I'm much more into salvation. Uh, in my life, I will save you. But that that's bad too. Huh? Like playing to be salvation of somebody else. Like mm -hmm. it's probably the better better than the two others. But even that, it's uh, there is uh, like playing around to be the salvator. Mm -hmm. It's not that good. But it's for sure better than prosecutor and victim. Um, so we are now in June and she's uh, angry against me, her boyfriend is super angry mm -hmm. and I have to explain them that I'm sorry, it was just a, just a game from the teacher and I was only playing a game, not, uh, I would not have done that. Never I would do that. I never done that in my but life. What, uh, what, what is strange to me is that uh, that, like, to me, it's, it seems like there were no boundaries set before the exercise. Exa exactly, yeah. The, mm -hmm. the teacher apologized this time because she said, okay, yeah. next time we should maybe That's have, like, fault, a, maybe a blind, f but no, just a rope or a, a, something, a rock we put on the floor saying stop. Yeah. Like stop the working. BDSM scene, yeah. uh, a, a friend of mine is explain explaining me what is BDSM. They have the, the, these rule of code, like yeah, red, red, <laughs> stop. Mm. 
so she, yeah. But there was no, so I couldn't know. And when she, she said what, but I, but I ran. Yeah. But I ran? I ran, like I ran away from you. She did? Yeah. Mm. She was like <laughs> running uh, among the people. But okay. How could I know that you are like beyond the, the, the sanity? <laughs> like, like, okay, that's too much. I don't know. And you chased her? Or what? Yeah, I chased her, mm. of course. Yeah, yeah. That's my role. And she was still blindfolded? Or no? uh, we were not blindfolded okay. in this exercise. No? Blindfold was uh, yeah. my exercise yeah. and the one from the Buto teacher. Okay. Mm. Mm. So, so, I'm sorry. That's not my goal of, of doing that. Mm. And the teacher was uh, was making things like uh, soft, like, oh, you know, he's a he's a very intense man, and uh, mm -hmm. because she she was she was uh, careful for the for the for the image of her school that uh, no one is getting out like traumatized. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> but in fact, in reality, she she was not like because I I had the feeling she was supporting me, but she was not. She she was. Uh, she was officially for, for calming everybody, but um, but uh, the end of the year came, and we had uh, one week. I had a feeling it's two weeks, but it's one week. It was too long. <laughs> it was terrible. We were in the in the land somewhere in the. In a, in a school, school uh, I don't know what, uh, I don't know, I don't know the word. And it has been terrible, she brought us into, um, she was really manipulating our mind to, to bring us in a, in a fucked up zone. Okay, she was using uh, what any sect would do, like keeping us tired. So the first night we had a, okay, we will make a chocolate uh, ceremony. It was nine o'clock at the, the, the Friday evening. And me, <laughs> chocolate, I don't know why. Cacao ceremony. Yeah. Eh? Cacao ceremony. Yeah, yeah, but, well, I said chocolate, but no, it's cacao. It's mm -hmm. more, it's much, <laughs> it's more, uh, it's more hippie like that. Mm -hmm. uh, so yeah, I totally fall in the trap because I was thinking, okay, we are beginning by a party. Why not? Okay, I like parties and I was really enjoying and when, when she was uh, dancing, uh, I jump into the dance. Of course, I want to, 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 to be part and to create, to follow the, the wave and to create a wave behind me of this dance and party but no one hour later it was finished and go to sleep everybody we have yoga tomorrow at seven o'clock okay. uh, what because i ate a lot of cacao i'm <laughs> super high and i guess everybody <laughs> i went to, to to bed i couldn't sleep i woke up at six o'clock or five four i don't know <laughs> just woke up not no, no, stand up i never slept I stand up, I go to eat a little, maybe it could help me to, <laughs> to sleep. There I find somebody else, like same thing, like mm. oh, I can't sleep. Mm. So the Thai Saturday I'm super sleepy because I didn't sleep. Mm. And that's something sick do. When they want, when you want to break people, mm. you, you just make so that they don't sleep. And there were there was many things she uh, she did uh, during this uh, during this week this long week breaking us. Mm -hmm. One thing she did was a ceremony for me, especially for me. Now this one is for. And but for the others as well, individually. For, for others, yeah, there was many things. Now it's nine years ago. 
you know, there was many things done to to create a like a feeling of group and there will be this magic happening. Mm. Me, she, 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 she gathered a circle of um, men. I want to say about how many men. Uh, I had a, sh- <laughs> I had a long hair, very long hair at the end of the year, and and I had three, five dreads behind, mm-hmm. just the the only dreads I kept from a, from a travel a few years before. And uh, I couldn't shave them because it's my dreads. Uh, so I just, I just cut everything on the unless the bread. I was looking like a Krishna. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> Why not? <laughs> and uh, she made a ceremony, so I would she would cut my bread. It's like, come, wow! It's so it's so invasive to mm-hmm. to to, to ob- obligate me to cut my bread. Yeah. Wow, so I had to cut my dreads, and you did. There was so many people like we love you. You have to, you have to get off these things that are. Yeah. Because you know. But she didn't say it before. Like she, she announced it in the group. She was not even there. She, no, no, she was. It was uh, delegated to another guy. Like. My friend, well. my friend, because uh, he's my, he was my friend, but mm. it was done with love. It, I was saying, okay, this is the top of my bindi. Bindi is the, this energy at the top of the, the spine. That's mm. exactly where my dreads were. And I was saying, oh, it's a, the expansion of my bindi. It's, no, it's the cover of your bindi. <laughs> you have to remove that. Mm. And it... And then, and then they start playing on something weird, so weird, like him. No, he started, like, we knew each other since a long time. And okay, you have to know that his name is Matthew. Matthew is the name of an evangelist. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And my, my name, my plastic name from the government, is a Christian, the mm-hmm. Christ. So, and he was playing a, a game of, you know, we we know we, we know each other since mm-hmm. ever. Whoa. And I was in, in this atmosphere, tired, in this mystical environment of. Mm-hmm. I was looking at him and what are you talking about? Mm-hmm. <laughs> and so, and all these people around, we love you. You have to, to go beyond to just. And then I I had um I had a gas mask from the war mm-hmm. beside my my camping tent, <laughs> mm-hmm. tent, yeah, tent. Mm-hmm. and with a with a nose a nose of a, a clown a clown <laughs> nose, mm-hmm. and and it was written, respire expire no inspire expire inspire uh, insp- expire inspire. It's a joke, you know, it was my totem. Yeah. And you know what? They were free enough to say, okay, this is this is satanic. <laughs> you have to burn it. Why? And they gave me my mask. I I I love that. <laughs> I was punk enough to, a few years before to do a performance with that. And, mm-hmm. and it was a joke. There was a clown nose on it. And mm-hmm. You have to burn it. It's satanic. <laughs> hey, what? Jesus. And I did, I did everything because there was such a, a love uh, imposition of tyranny, a love tyranny. And mm. Okay, I cut my dread and I was, uh, I, I was beginning to, to get very confused. Huh? I was like, okay, the war, we know each other, uh, satanic, uh, satanic. <laughs> uh, okay, I was burning things. We made a circle. Ah, and there was a guy, okay, this guy. He looked like he has some part of the face that looked like uh, me and br- uh, cousins of mine. Like he was, he was like a, like a, br- like a cousin, like a brother. He, as if he was from my family. And, and he was, he has been chosen among the, the, the men. 
بيبنى ملبس يوميا يبنى يبنى هني واس كمان كمان يبنى 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 so intense but never as intense as that <laughs> but now it was she, 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 she pushed the line so far so far during this week but how how did she because she was not there but she instructed those guys to to say those things to you yeah yeah but, but you why? know my, my friend was uh, the guy from the restaurant was um, my first minute meditation teacher he, he didn't he didn't need her to be uh, mm -hmm. focused on how to do the ceremony and she... <sighs> and do you know no you don't know <laughs> they were they had uh, gathering among her and this friend uh, this uh, restaurant guy and and others every evening very serious very like oh, as as I did love before, something very intense, but now it was not fun at all. Mm -hmm. uh, and during this ceremony, one of the girls said, you know that she was saying you're the devil? What? Okay, that's freak. That's mm -hmm. really crazy, okay? Mm -hmm. And this girl, okay, this girl left after one month. She got depressed after after this this week and everybody left this the school because in the in the year after because okay it was too far. Mm -hmm. <sighs> oh la la So this girl I met on the street just just when I was uh, back from India because I left I left to India after after the after the class I was so depressed after the the, the whole week, the whole mm -hmm. thing. I had to, I had to go away. I've been super depressed too. Mm -hmm. I met this girl and she told me everything and I, th I told her, oh, I still have respect uh, for the teacher and she said... You met a girl and she... She met the, the assistant of the teacher. So she was there, she was there... Uh, of the woman. With the, the, with the great master, she was, uh, she was assisting. She was, a the, she was a teacher at the yoga school. But now you're talking about India. Yeah, yeah. I went to India. When I came back to India, I met this girl on the street. When you came back from India. Yeah. Okay. I've so been I've here. been to India before the the, the the yoga school and after the so the, Okay. The, yeah. But this girl you met in India or here? No, here. Okay. Yeah. And uh, and. Uh, and I said I have I, I still had respect for the teacher and the master, mm. and she said not me. She's really crazy. <laughs> <laughs> she's really she 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 was uh, like psycho psychologically manipulating everybody, even mm. her assistant. Ah, mm. uh, you know. But she was her assistant. And yeah, she was her assistant, oh, okay. but she quit, mm -hmm. and she quit by herself and many other after after the, during the the year after everybody was traumatized by mm -hmm. the behavior of this master. <laughs> mm -hmm. Um, but it's and this girl, this assistant, mm -hmm. that's the one who came like something like the. Three night before it finishes. And look, look, look. Before it finishes. <laughs> the, the, the 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 week the week in the in the land. Ah, but I th I thought you met her after the week. No 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 no. She was in the week. Okay. But I met, like just meeting on the street. Within the week, after the week. No no, <laughs> I don't know what meet what means meet in in English. Week. Meet. Meet. So I met her yeah. after the week on the street, but I knew her before she was giving classes in the yoga school. Okay. Uh, okay. And, uh, and, and uh, the, there's an evening where um, there was um, lightning. So in the week? During the week. Okay. We were uh, outside and 
it looked like all the classes were finished. Uh, it was time to go to bed, but it was wonderful. There was lightnings, like mm. one after the other, to the far, not even hearing anything, I think. Mm. And yeah, it was a great show. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then the, came, the teacher came very square. <laughs> she said, the commander of the fifth um, uh, spaceship <laughs> said that you are the chosen one for the revolution on Earth. <laughs> she said that to you? She said that to everybody. Uh, what the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> <laughs> and these lightnings, no, and, and mm -hmm. she said this is the flashes of their photo camera to take us in picture. <laughs> <laughs> my problem this week is that I was always half like eh. <laughs> it's a joke it's ridiculous <laughs> and half like uh, sometime it was on the edge on the edge yeah. of, of sanity eh? yeah. and look that okay there it's a joke like mm -hmm. <laughs> it's ridiculous I hope this week is finishing <laughs> I hope to have my yoga certificate and I hope to <laughs> To go away from the school, it's much too crazy. <laughs> it's not finished. Mm. So then she turns, she will, she goes again. <laughs> She's gone. <laughs> okay. And then it, uh, the, 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 the storm comes, uh, the lightning here, and then. <laughs> and it, not, not now. Now it's uh, soon. Eh? It's soon. Some drops of water, some drops. And then the assistant of the teacher, the same that I met. Uh, few one year after mm -hmm. and she comes and she says uh, you maestram you always been too related to the source just see yourself you are not ma maestram anymore you are christian can you can you relate to your source it was so theatrical so Wah! and there was lightning behind her <laughs> Oh my God. And oh, then, then the, 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 the storm came, and, and then I stand up and I say, I don't know what to say. <laughs> <laughs> I say, I don't want to, 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 to cheat, you know. Okay, yes, during these days I could connect to the, the little boy in me that was called Christian. Yes, yes, I can connect to that. I see the maelstrom around, I see it's a, a very powerful entity. Yeah, <laughs> and I see a lot, <laughs> because there was a fucking maelstrom around us. <laughs> it was a tornado, <laughs> and, the, and the water in the face. <laughs> and there was a, a, um, a friend uh, beside me. I will have to make a flashback with that. By the way, she was basically, she was with your name, like she was saying... Yeah, because it, this was all the point. To make peace with your Christian? Yeah, yeah, that was uh, all the point of the, 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 the ceremonies. Mm -hmm. and, like I had to, 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 cut, uh, to cut my dreads, to burn my, uh, my, uh, my totem. Mm -hmm. And I had to come back to Christian, which is mm -hmm. the name that was given by my mother. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, but you know... Native American, they, they go a ceremony, they do a ceremony when they, are, when they are 18 and they go in the forest to find their totem animal and they come back and they change name. Mm -hmm. That's all right too. This is, uh, I was talking about Heraclit, the philosopher, changing, changing. Mm -hmm. Just find your way, your own destiny, find, become something. Become, become, and become, and become. <laughs> and for me, my drama was a part of changing, just discovering a new me, and what is me anyway? What mm -hmm. is what is Christian? What is my strum? What is names? Names? Just me. Mm. Mm. Yeah, <laughs> I decided to get to be called like that, and, and once I was changing you, names. Did you do you feel like it really changed something for you? Or? Because of stories like that, yes, mm. I like it was imposed, like it's serious. Another thing also, mm. it's one day you can't ch keep changing name, because if you are doing, uh, I'm a massage therapist, mm. <coughs> I am a poet, I want to 
to be known. Mm -hmm. And in fact, editors, especially, <laughs> they want to keep a fixed name. Mm -hmm. So one day, okay, my son, it seems that I will keep this one. Mm -hmm. I have this since a while. And mm -hmm. There is a, like a force to, to keep me into that name. So my flashback now. Um, that I had a friend there. And we were very close together. It started uh, very innocently because I was uh, assisting a yoga class. Uh, yeah, I was assisting a class of the master. Mm -hmm. I didn't know because I didn't read carefully, I guess, the, the sheet of the rules. You know? But we had to assist two classes of a teacher in the school. Mm -hmm. But we were not supposed to assist the teacher, the master. <laughs> But I went to assist the, the master, and she went, okay. You know, I, I was saying that we had like a, a, yeah. a relation of, okay, she, she said, okay, be there for, be there and you can assist me. So I was like, That was after the week? No. Before? There was nothing after the week. Okay. After the, the week, it was apocalypse. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> It was before, during the year in yeah. Montreal, okay. in the studio, in the year of yoga. Yeah. <clears throat> when it was yoga and before it became a, a theatrical, esoteric and masterpiece. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and this, the, this friend, uh, I didn't know her at all, but she started crying during the class. But at, at the end of the class, because it was so intense that... I don't know what could have say, uh, what could have told uh, the teacher or whatever what happened in, inside her. But she was crying, so I went to her to give her a support, a little hug. Hmm. And uh, this day of the storm with the lightnings all around, like. Okay, that's really intense. Like, they, they, and they keep me to this Christianity, Christian Jesus. Am I Jesus? What is this? They are totally freaked. Why they say that? And but again, you know, you are tired, and they mm. they bring you always you know, in this fucked up state of mind of esoteric, and mm -hmm. you don't believe anymore, and. I'm not stubborn on anything, so if if I was, it would keep me really strong. And uh, mm -hmm. but ooh, why not? Why not? I'm just, I'm not I've been the Christ. <laughs> That's so <laughs> typical. Any any guy in the in the psych, in psychiatric hospital thinks he's, he has been Jesus. <laughs> no, no, I didn't want to be at all. <laughs> but they were so imposing me like this kind of Christian, your Christ, you know. And then okay, and she she leaves in the theater of the storm, and uh, I am alone with under the rain with my friend and. I ask her, you, you, you want to come in my in my tent? I, I need somebody. I cannot be alone. And she mm -hmm. said, yeah, yeah, me too, me too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so we went there and just like in each in our sleeping bag. And, What's uh -huh. that? And, I, and then I asked her, have you been Maria Magdalena? <laughs> 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 Could you? <laughs> and she says, I was thinking exactly <laughs> the same. <laughs> She was saying, why am I there in your story? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> it's not my story. It's their story. <laughs> I don't understand nothing. <laughs> but are you Maria Magdalena? <laughs> no, we were, I, we were half joking, half not. Yeah. We were like super like... It was like how I felt on LSD. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, but, it's, but it, it was totally natural in SD. It was uh, mm -hmm. one week of manipulating the brain to make it. Mm -hmm. Because she wanted to break egos, and I have a big mm -hmm. ego, and they know, <laughs> and mm -hmm. I know. <laughs> I try to 
like it's a big horse and you go oh, you have to uh, ju don't jump off, uh, off of it uh, take care that your don't horse is not hurting anybody around you know that's ego it's a like it's a projection of yourself into something else which is now a horse <laughs> why not <laughs> so okay you have to be careful with that they know I have an ego and they want to break it because religion or sect, a sect and a religion, it's the same, eh? mm -hmm. a religion is a sect that had success. Mm -hmm. So their religion, their sect, uh, want to break people's ego. So at the but end... But what was your goal, you know, was her, her goal? Her goal mm -hmm. To be the master. But she already was. <laughs> no, but she could be bigger master. Mm -hmm. Bigger, bigger. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. It, it's not finishing there the story okay. with her. <laughs> no, no, she did. Uh, she might have put fire in her school for getting bigger. Fire? Yeah. Like real fire? Yeah. I'm no proof of that. I'm just. Okay. Who knows? <laughs> Who knows? Huh? I have no truth mm -hmm. <laughs> with a big T. Mm -hmm. Just. Objections. Yeah, <laughs> okay. I know she could. And the, but school, the school was set on fire. Yeah, the school was set on fire and she moved into a bigger place. Mm -hmm. I don't know what kind of <laughs> connections she has. But if you set yourself in the, into the level of people, you know, there is uh, all this. to sing sectarian charismatic people sectarian <coughs> yeah sectarian you could say who get very important they have followers and they get big and big and big and big mm -hmm. just set the this teacher and to this master and to this portrait, big portrait of <coughs> the family portrait <coughs> of these people uh, that you can see on YouTube uh, or TED, <laughs> like so charismatic and so followed by groupies. Mm -hmm. Who knows where somebody can stop? And that's the that's the main point, uh, that's the, my main like psychotic phase that came after. But now, <laughs> let's finish. <clears throat> Before psychotic, but I was already into uh, like, uh, and I'm not so fragile, I'm, I'm living my, 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 my life peacefully, and trying not to be too crazy, <laughs> but she, she was real. Uh, leading us to, to something very deep, mm -hmm. as you can see. I was, remember, uh, telling to the people that I was the, the, the devil, what I did. And, and uh, what I did is this story. With the girl? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, I, she, she told us she has been uh, raped, the, the teacher and the master. But she was raped? She, she has been raped mm -hmm. in a, before in our life, in our life. Mm -hmm. uh, I really think she has something crunchy <laughs> inside that is not solved. Mm -hmm. And uh, one day she made a big circle of everybody, everybody it was two or three, two classes, two classes of 60 people, I think. Oh. Is it possible? Yeah, there was a lot of people. <laughs> eh? 120 people? Maybe, yeah, it was big. Eh? Mm. It was, uh, yeah, she had a lot of followers. Mm. And that's each year. And they keep coming in the school and making the school bigger. And that's why she was, it was too small, her school. Mm. It was, it was so full packed each of her class she needed 
<laughs> I say nothing. <laughs> I say nothing. More. So yeah, she why to set it on fire? It doesn't make sense. You can just quit rent and rent another place. Right? Oh yeah, yeah, it could. It's my hypothesis. I, mm -hmm. I, that, but you yeah, know what? I when understand. I'm talking about that, I get a bit psychotic, paranoid, schizophrenic, yeah. whatever. <laughs> I get really crazy, so I, it puts me in a state of mind of. Everything is possible yeah. with her. She has no limit. She's manipulating so deep. Mm -hmm. <sighs> mm -hmm. uh, so, we were that day of everybody in a circle and she she brought two person in the, in the front like uh, one had uh, one uh, start to, to have a relation with another te teacher, mm -hmm. a, a yoga teacher from the school. So there, there was a yoga teacher in the school who quit one to go to another one. Person. Girl. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, and, uh, and how many teachers were there in the school? Me. So uh, she made an old drama for that, yeah, involving two persons that, like, she was a bit of a, of a friend, yeah, we, we saw... To you? Yeah, the new who, the new? To you or to her? To, to me, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I, I invited her to, for a heart, heart uh, performance, yeah, mm -hmm. to help me on something. Whatever, what I don't remember. Well, she was kind of a friend, mm -hmm. <laughs> and she, she, she didn't ask this circumstance of being mm -hmm. in front of one hundred twenty person, oh having to to to, uh, to 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 defend herself. To yes, I'm, I have a relation with this year, yeah. <laughs> this man, <laughs> and, and the other one. I'm so sorry, mm -hmm. and it was so. <laughs> and I start crying because mm -hmm. it was so intense and I was so on my emotions mm -hmm. that um, I start crying for uh, I just quit my my girlfriend just mm -hmm. like uh, one year before and, and I was I never cried for for that mm -hmm. and it was stuck really. Mm -hmm. And finally, because of all the circumstance of emotion, 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 I start to cry. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so I had no connection with that. But then she made a speech on women in the world as being uh, disrespected by the men. And, 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 and the women among, among themselves as to be careful for each other and they shouldn't cheat one on the other. And, and my friend... Uh, <laughs> mm -hmm. And me crying, and and now I was seeing like a new perspective of, of what leads this, the the master. I'm like, okay, the feminism is was very, and she has been raped, mm -hmm. and she has something that she she wants to. We, we will eat the chunk, <laughs> you know. Mm -hmm. We will uh, we will have to to go through that. And uh, she made a, and and then she made a very sexist ceremony, where um, it was almost the last day. <coughs> we had to um, to go in the in the mud and to put mud in, on ourselves, mm -hmm. and then to relax in the mud. Yeah, that's okay. Wait, <laughs> it's coming. Mm -hmm. And then, uh, oh, it was so ridiculous the way she said it. There was one guy, I don't know why. I, would, I don't know why she chose this one, but I chose him to lead the group. And I have reason for that. <laughs> I don't want to share with you. <laughs> Mystery. Mm. He's the one. And my ego was a bit broke, like, uh, mm. broken, because... Uh, few months before it, it could have been me. 
<laughs> but now you know my ego is a bit uh, broken. I admit, but uh, deeply, and uh, but yeah, deeply. But now this was struck out. Yeah, okay. I was not a. Uh, I was not expecting to be. Uh, to be the one that would be picked it. So. And then we walked toward the lake, and that's where I had the feeling of there was really. Okay, I told you huh, she was theatrical. Mm -hmm. She is so theatrical. Look what she said. First, it was a woman going naked. First, it's sexist, okay? Because I go to Rainbow Gathering, everybody get naked and wash all together, and we don't care. The simple fact for me of dividing men and women mm -hmm. is is already sexist. Mm -hmm. I we don't care, and we are conscious people. We can be all naked all together. I don't know the point, of, but the, probably this uh, over caring about some women could be uncomfortable. And then men will wait, and we have been waiting very long. It was, we were in the shade with mud and, mm -hmm. and it was cold. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and even my the, the resto the, the restaurant guy, the, the raw food restaurant guy, who was the, the leader of the men, he was uh, just coming more <laughs> <laughs> and trying to. <laughs> <Can you go? laughs> no, we had to wait. Okay. And then, okay, he got the call. Okay, so we can go. But uh, they were all there, all around watching us. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's so strange situation. Mm -hmm. They were all watching us. What she said, I don't know. Why was it like that? And we were a bit shy. We, we were hearing them like having much fun. <laughs> And for us, it was so uh, yeah, mm -hmm. and you wash away snow, and, and I have no conclusion about that. <laughs> no, nothing tangible. <laughs> mm -hmm. Nothing. But I have a feeling of sexism there, mm -hmm. and I have a feeling of revenge. They didn't say anything after about that. No, no, no. You know, each everything that we that we experienced, there was no, no after talking of that, no explanation. But, oh my God! There's something I didn't tell you, <laughs> because there's so many things that in this week. Okay. Right after the ceremony, they made for me, they cut my, my dreads, okay, I was now Christian, and uh, my mask was uh, burnt. You, you were Christian? Yeah. yeah, now I was Christian. Uh, mm. Forget about my son, he's not allowed anymore. <laughs> I come back in the studio where all the others were doing, doing yoga, but not us, because of my ceremony. And then, uh, well, I'll do some yoga. It's great for the other, but okay, I'll do some yoga. And then I'm doing that, and then I'm doing the cavalier. Cavalier is this posture. Because I see her coming, and uh, for me this posture is devotion. That's my own poetry about that. That's uh, and I, I wanted, I had two two reason to 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 make this, uh, you know, devotion. First, because uh, during the year. Uh, I had some devotion for her, and second because now I was scared a little, mm -hmm. and I wanted to submit like, you know, like during one week I, I'm not responsible for myself anymore. I'm, I mean, I'm, I'm not. I'm responsible for myself, but what how to say? I'm not. It's not my boat. <laughs> She's the captain of the boat, and I no, I don't know. Like, and nobody knows where is going the boat. Mm. <sighs> And uh, yeah, maybe there was something like that. And you know what she did? Something totally crazy. She started to, <laughs> and she she quit. 
as if she made like some kind of witch, mm -hmm. like spiritual spirits, like like rejecting me. Wow, I was I felt so bad, like. <laughs> No, okay. So it was already the beginning of this huge gap she was putting between me and her and the rest of the world. Mm. So, oh, you want you want another one about extraterrestrial? That's that's a parenthesis, but because it. There's a, it's not what leads to craziness, but a little bit. Uh, she she explained us uh, the the flower of life. Mm -hmm. So uh, at the beginning, I thought it was very interesting. There is the one, there is the two. Two is duality, and there is the three. Three is uh, the other. Like there is one, two, and three is. Three is unity. Mm, not not unity. It's the other. I don't remember well what she said, but it, I found it was really interesting, it's especially as, as a last day. Uh, it was like, a, yeah, it was fun to give some nourishment to my intellectuals mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. instead of emotional. Yeah. <laughs> so okay, and then she said, um, "This is the representation of uh, of the whole world, the galaxies, and you know." Um, the Earth is not in the middle. The Earth is very far on the side. She she pointed, and me, my planet is from the center. That's where I come from. Your planet. Her planet. What was it called? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> 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 and uh, <laughs> and she said, "I've been sent to you to to bring you to me." And then people were laughing. Ah, you were you were probably comfortable eh, on your planet. Eh? You are very generous to come here. Yeah. <laughs> and then there was some kind of laughing. But mm. what is she saying? Mm. It's totally crazy. <laughs> but uh, it, all the lo all the week long, it was the same. I was in between of it's a joke and. Is she saying this? Yeah. <laughs> what is she saying? <laughs> oh, wow. And always this lack of, uh, of sleep and everything. I was really tired. Mm -hmm. So I got, um, I came, I came to, to this place in the land, um, to this eco spiritual center by bike. Uh, and I had my bike and I had my things. And the, the girl who brought me, um, I let her my things. I, I just keep my I keep my, my bike. I let her. I told her I would come later to get my things by her place. Mm -hmm. I'm not carrying it. So this Friday evening was one of the most crazy in my life. I start running anywhere. I was riding in places in Montreal I don't know and I just wanted to ride and ride and ride and ride. Mm -hmm. And I was thinking, thinking, thinking about okay, is she so powerful? Does she want to destroy me? Does she want to destroy what she wants to build? And she was Talking about uh, okay, there will be uh, they will be planting a new tree of life in this island in Hawaii because it has been cut and then we have to build another to to plant another one. And will be the, will will she be there? Will she be the the leader of the world, uh, bringing all all the people together? I know she can do it. She's powerful. She's strong. She's she's very beautiful in this. But I'm, but I'm, but I'm afraid, and uh, and and then I wanted to to to, to disappear from the world. Uh, okay, she's so powerful that she can she can destroy me, and she she can uh, she can uh, 
Okay, I want, I, I want, I, I have, I want no power. I, I don't like these, uh, these communities of power. I don't like these, uh, these, uh, so secret societies. I don't. Who, who? who well, I'm sure. I'm sure she is. Uh, she has secret, secret society behind her. She's supported somehow, and I, I kind of believe that. <laughs> and I was thinking and thinking and running. And is she, is she right? Maybe she's right. Maybe this esoteric world exists. I was so confused, and then uh, I stopped. I stopped somewhere. I was at the end of the island. I was on the side of the river. And then I had so much energy. I, I, I put my bike off. I was in the, in the, in the, in the, in the, in the grass. And uh, so too much energy. I start turning around like Sufi style. <laughs> spinning, spinning, spinning. And then I realized, oh, this is, I'm creating a maelstrom. And I felt so powerful, like in that, like it was so good to me for to, to, to spin on place. Okay, she's afraid of the maelstrom because maelstrom is powerful. <sighs> okay, <laughs> so okay, she wants to destroy my throne because I'm powerful. Oh, am I so powerful? Well, what is that? What should I believe? What should I do with this with this strength? Oh no, I don't want to be part of this this theatrical uh, force field of whatever esoteric. No, I don't know. I don't want to disappear. And I jump on my bike and I go again. And I was really didn't know who I am, why, why, why is that? Uh, and then I came home uh, just to rest, and I was so empty, so dead, so. Uh, and um, <clears throat> two days after I received the mail, she said. Um, uh, you are fired from the school and uh, you'll get your money back. Bring all your book. I want a yoga book. And I came there. You know, you, because you had coaching or something? Yeah, school. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah. It was like a little ceremony, but not. Nah, we were back in Montreal on Rue Saint Denis, so not too esoteric, mm -hmm. you know. Keep, <laughs> keep <Okay>. standard. Yeah. <laughs> so, a little ceremony with people. She was giving me money. I was giving her a little bit. Did that, and then she wrote on a message that I was a public danger for women. <laughs> voilà. Voilà, <de> voilà. <laughs> a public message? A, a, yeah, a public message to everyone, to the 120 students wow. of the school. And then everybody was a bit shy to meet me sometime later. I don't know. Um, Christian? <laughs> uh, <Marcel? Yeah. laughs> Tell me the way you want. <laughs> I don't care. Mm -hmm. So you see how you can take little something, nothing at all. Mm -hmm. And because it was useful for her mm -hmm. to, uh, to put that in her machine and <laughs> make so at the end that uh, I become the, the devil, the, mm -hmm. The bad, the big bad wolf. Mm -hmm. But I did. Mm -hmm. But nothing in this story. Mm -hmm. And it's the opposite. After so many people quit her because everybody knew she was, uh, she was crazy. Mm -hmm. But the way of mm -hmm. one hundred students. Sense. Like, oh, is a danger for women. But what what was her message? What did she say? I don't remember the rest. Mm -hmm. We decided to to kick out uh, Christian because uh, at the end of the day, he's not uh, conformed to uh, to the identity of the school. Mm -hmm. Bunch of things.
but you know and if you want to 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 gather in America against the Arab and you make two towers falling maybe it's an hypothesis but very interesting if you want to gather a yoga school you decide that this guy is the devil so it's gathering the people against him mm -hmm. it's always good to have uh, the devil somewhere mm -hmm. the opposition force is making your own force bigger So now I live with uh, this, that way. Like <clears throat> last year, when uh, somebody st start to to claim uh, this drama queen, not happy that I left her. And not happy that you that you. I left her because mm -hmm. I was not in love, so I, I quit her. Then she made a big drama queen story. The fact that I've been abusing her, mm. but that was she was happy on, uh, until I leave her. I was happy, but when I was leaving her, I was uh, abusing her. Find find the truth in it. But it was a girl with a man story. Yeah, yeah, yeah. she invented a life story. <laughs> I found a joke. Mm -hmm. I found a joke that I couldn't do. <laughs> but it's just time. <laughs> so she, when she spread. There was one girl, she was in, a, in, the, in this yoga school, in this new yoga school that is now not anymore in, in Saint-Denis Street. And I felt like for now, it will be all the time like a, a soupçon, a feeling that uh, people are talking and the fact that she knows that this girl is talking to this girl that knows the, the, the school and that school is saying that I am. It's everywhere mm. spreading like a mm. big wave of getting bigger upon nothing. There was mm. nothing at the base. I was not abusing this, this, uh, this, uh, this girl last year mm -hmm. and I, I did nothing wrong against women. Mm -hmm. And during the yoga year, yeah. but and now how to stop a wave when people start to to think about this girl? Mm -hmm. So now when when I receive a like a, a message from a from a fr from a friend saying oh you shouldn't talk to that to that guy because it seems that he was abusing us. Swimming, I don't know. So hey, whoa, whoa, okay. You the, is is this is this first hand information or you just heard about that because I don't take cash anything now 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 that I know what it is to have a, a reputation de destructed. Mm. Okay. And it's so easy on me because I'm so provoking all the time, but mm. on the edge. I do never I never been disrespectful, especially not to women. Mm. I know I've been promoting feminism, mm -hmm. so stop these um, stupidities. But the message you received today, it was a, you had a connection with this one. Yeah. I don't know. Mm-hmm.